So all of those, those issues. So, and, and the leaders that, people that do get there to the top are very often the wrong people. Uh, we, find, we, we, we find that many, many leaders, they have little idea of strategy. So again, what tends to happen in our selection processes for leaders, we identify that uh, you know, we, 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 we start off at people at junior management level, so they're supervisor, and we really don't want them to be strategic there, we want them to be operational. And so we select our middle managers for the most operationally minded people. And so basically, um, and in fact, even at middle management level, we don't want them to be strategic because that gets in the way. So we effectively, we actually winnow out from our organizations anybody who thinks strategically until we need to put to promote people into the top. And then we find we've got a whole bunch of people at the top who don't have a clue how to think strategically. Am I over-exaggerating this, or is this ring true? Yes. So uh, we've got some real issues that, that we find that basically, strategically, mo most management teams in uh, most of our leadership teams have struggled to find enough people who think strategically. You've typically got one or two people, and then the rest are function functionally focused. Um, and many of the management teams that I, that are leadership teams that I observe, um, uh, we, 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 we identify that, that, that the majority of people on those teams think mostly from their functional perspective first, but not from a collective leadership perspective after, after, uh, um, um, predominantly. Um, in very few organizations do we find that everybody's job description or everybody's accountabilities are the same at top at leadership level. But some companies are now making this, this shift, this, they, they're, they're, it's becoming increasingly common to say, no, you're not just responsible for HR, you're not just responsible for, for, for finance. Everybody on the leadership team is responsible for hitting the profit targets. Everybody's responsible for financial safety. Everybody's responsible for people. You all share collectively as a leadership team. And therefore, you all are, there, are accountable to supporting each other in achieving things. That's a very different perspective.